What's up, boys? It's Lemon Square. So, today, we got a real special package from the cubicle. I'm pretty sure it's sold out already. It is the random premium puzzle package. I'll explain it more in a second. So, let's get right into it. Okay, so basically, how this thing works is, um, <clears throat> um, it gives you a random premium puzzle, which means either Cubicle Pro Shop or Cubicle Apps. I don't think Angstrom's included in this. And um, it's guaranteed to be a value uh, higher than the price that you bought it for. So there's a $10 one, a $20 one, and a $30 one. And so yeah, this is guaranteed to be, guaranteed to be over $20 because I got the $20 one. It's going to be magnetic either way because it is a premium cube. I don't think there's any cubicle apps or pro shop cubes that are uh, non-magnetic. Now oh, here we go. All right. So it comes with the new cubicle.com card. Uh, Angstrom Research. Does, I don't know if that means if it's an Angstrom cube. But if it does, then good for me. And uh, sucks for you if you didn't get one. So uh, here it is. $20 one. We got the receipt. Uh, that's it. So, here we go. Let's get right, right into it, guys. And uh, it's a 3x3 three three, or stickered. And I have no idea what this is. Comes with a stand, black stand. That's cool. I don't have one of those. And I have no idea what the heck this is. I don't like that orange. Just gotta say. Just gotta say. So I was just informed this may or may not be a U Shell Pro M, which I'm kind of annoyed by because you know it's a U Shell Pro. Oh, jeez. Uh, okay. So, anyways, let's open this boy up. I don't know. I'm not a huge fan of stickered cubes. I enjoy these stickerless shades more. And I don't know if this could be an MGC. Let's check the internals, and that is definitely a U Shell Pro, I guess. So, um, a bit booby on the outside. Let's see how it turns. Okay, right now, it's pretty gummy. Um, hold up, hold up. Is this non-magnetic? This might not actually be magnetic. Uh... What the hell? Uh, I don't know. I wasn't expecting this. That's for sure. And uh, this might not be magnetic. Hold up. Okay, guys. Turns out this is a magnetic cube, but it. Definitely has the light magnets. These are some small magnets, and I can barely feel the magnetic bump. So yeah, a U Shell Pro M. I've never turned one of these, and I didn't plan to turn one of these because it's nothing compared to our uh, big flagships nowadays. So yeah, I'm a bit uh, irked that I got this cube because you know it's like kind of trash. I feel like I'm ragging on this cube too much, but like when I say it's trash. Uh, you know, it was probably good in like, you know, like 2016. So now, uh, kind of, uh, I don't know, it kind of has a nice soft feel. It definitely is still really gummy. Fun fact, there's actually no You Shall Pro available in Cubicle Labs anymore. So, um, just a heads up, if you're considering buying one of these, which the $20 one is only available today at, uh, only available as of today, uh, March 11th, and I think they're just dumping out their old cubes that they had on cubicle.us, but right now, corner cutting is pretty good, I'm not so sure about that sky blue, never been a big fan of that, uh, and the orange does look a little bit poopy, um, but besides that, He's actually performing pretty well. Okay, um, did I get ripped off or something? I mean, I'm aware this was like a $26 cube. But this cube isn't even available on the cubicle anymore. Uh, so that's kind of, that's kind of sketchy right there already. I mean, it's an okay puzzle. Don't get me wrong. 
I don't know if I'll main over it. Uh, I don't know if I'll main with it over my Little Magic M. Corner, uh, corners was kind of easily because it's got some rounded corners. And overall, the stickers are placed place pretty nicely. It's like it's a nice looking cube. I mean, at first I thought it was an MGC, but nah. So if you guys are considering getting this on the cubicle, um, just be aware you can, uh, you may get an older puzzle, such as this one, which is no longer available. And overall, this cube, uh, it turns pretty well. Uh, it flows very nicely. It has a good feel. And uh, the magnets are very light, though. So I may or may not make a review on this compared to my Little Magic M. Who knows? So yeah, that is my unboxing of the random premium $20 cube from the cubicle.us. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And uh, yeah, I'm trying to upload more consistently. It's just this is the first video idea that came up in a while. So yeah, if you guys liked this cubing video, um, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're new. Also, um, I might start making new vlogs as the weather is getting way better. And I can go outside more. So if you want new vlogs, make sure to comment that you want new vlogs. Also, make sure to go subscribe to my boy Rapti and uh, spam his videos telling him he needs to uh, upload. And yeah, uh, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Oh, God. Also, guys, another thing I forgot to mention is that this cube is the light magnet version of the Glowgon UHL Pro-Am because it has the two orbits around the cubicle logo as you can see sorry I didn't mention this and uh, sorry it's not filmed on my setup I didn't want to set I didn't want to do my setup over again so yeah this is the cubicle labs Glowgon UHL Pro Light M alright okay actually what the f